First graders are capable of learning anything and all students learn in different ways. So my job as their teacher is to allow them to express themselves. My name is Ashley Greenway. I teach first grade at Elm Street Elementary in Rome, Georgia, and I am an Allen Distinguished Educator. We're gonna get to go work with the worm lab. I brought some new worms in this morning. Yay. Oh, really? Yeah, you're gonna have to observe and then you're gonna have to tell me what you find out. The younger children are full of curiosity and I like to instill that drive to explore and engage with other friends before they're too cautious or timid. What's he doing? They all got scared. Worms were something that they were really curious about after seeing them in our garden. So it was a natural fit to bring them inside the classroom and let them observe them up close to see what they liked and what they didn't like. What are you finding out? Are they liking the hot or do they like the cold? They like the hot and really. Right now they're trying to enhance our strawberry garden with the worms and it'll be really neat to see how they put that together. When we see what they like the most, then we do put them in the strawberry patch and then let them help the strawberries. I think during the course of a day, the student should be exposed to as much as possible. And so I give my students opportunities to be hands-on with different materials throughout the day. So some of you are gonna go create and problem solve in the maker space. Plan out your design and then create it. If it doesn't work, what's going to happen? If it doesn't work, should we just give up? No. What should no, we, we do? Just, we keep, keep trying. Keep, keep trying, trying, right? Look, Isaiah, it goes on the desk too. See, look. Holy moly. I like when other students get excited by what their friends are learning and are drawn into that. They're engaged with their friends and then they're learning from each other. And I think that's the most powerful thing about our classroom is that students are then teachers of other students. My ultimate goal as a teacher is to inspire kids to pursue their passions no matter what those passions may be. I want to be a scientist because we could do everything. My students surprise me constantly in the classroom. They're always teaching me things and teaching me new ways to look at a problem. How could we make it fit? <gasps> oh, cut! Cut what? Cut the apple! apple. We're going to cut the apple? Yes. When kids are learning to collaborate, work together, and go create, make, tinker, build, kids are capable of anything adults are. I am so proud of what my students have accomplished this year. They have stretched the boundaries of what many people thought that a first grader were capable of.